Hello again, Bear fans. I'm going to do a review that a lot of you guys will like. Normally, I've done light beer reviews or adjunct reviews or macro brews, we could call it, because I've looked at my views and my comments, and it's clear that's what you guys prefer, as well as my reviews of popular whiskeys. And so I believe in giving the market what it wants, because I believe in markets until you've gotten it. But occasionally, I want to talk about, hopefully with my audience, different beers. Now, I've never had this one before. This is the Dogfish Namaste, or Namaste. Namaste, we call it any different, kind of different name. And it's beer brewed with coriander, orange, and lemongrass. And so, you would expect it to be fruity. And unfortunately, I don't generally like fruity beer, but it's Dogfish Head. Now, the guy I bought this from made the interesting point that Dogfish Head is overpriced. And I think he's he's generally right. Um, that this, I believe, cost me at least ten dollars, and we'll see. But I would be shocked if this is as good as, say, a stone self righteous or ruination would have been. So let's make sure you get a better look at that beer. And so. And that's generally the case, even with the 120 minute, which is an interesting beer. I don't generally find it to actually be a beer I really, really want to drink. It's delicious. It's good. But I find the 90 and the 60 minute and the Razon de, et de Etra satisfy me pretty well. The 120 is good in small amounts, but I don't want it regularly. So, but the 120 cost $9. Which is not a good price for it. Um, for a 12-ounce beer. $9 for 12-ounce. I believe this is $10, and this is... 21 ounces. And on first taste, a very your continental flavor with continental kind of wheat and yeast kind of flavor mixed with spice and um Grapefruit. And that's that that is the taste. Um, a very sweet beer. A delicious beer, I should note. Um, and we don't say that enough in these reviews. This is a delicious beer. Um, and one that for a lower price, I would say, is an automatic try. Um, this is very high. And while I think the citrus just explodes at you, even in the even in the nose, you get spice, orange, and grapefruit, which smells amazing. I can't really, in good conscience, say. Whatever you do, go out and buy this because, again, this is awful expensive. 
If you like sweet beers, if you like what I like to term fruity beers, this is a delicious option. This, I'm, I don't know if it's aged as well at 5%, but again, if you like spice beers and fruity beers, this is a delicious option. However, if you're not in those two categories, this is a bit high. And while I'm not in those two categories, and I still say, I like, I'm enjoying, I could... This is fairly drinkable, has a nice little kick, a beautiful bouquet, a feeling of, um, of just fruity pleasantness, really. A word that I really like, fruity pleasantness. This has a, this personifies that term. Of fruity pleasantness. I don't feel that you're going to regularly buy this. But if you are like me and you are a um, experienced junkie, whereby I mean that I seek out new things. Uh, Excuse me. I prefer new things to old things. I prefer new good things to new... to old good things. And this is a must drink. Because the lemon's coming out now. It, I think it advertises lemongrass. And it's starting to come, really come out now at this point. Because this beer is delicious. It is pricey, but delicious. And so if you want to try something new you haven't tried before, this beer is delicious. Man, it's, I mean, just, there's not a bad flavor in that. Everything is citrusy goodness. This beer is almost like candy. However, many of my, my viewers, I know, are not experienced drinkers. And are not people who try to experience everything. And if you are not in that category... This is not worth the price. You can build to spiced beers and to um, oh, beers with a very slightly different yeast at a much cheaper price than this. They might not be quite as good, but they're going to get you prepared. And so until you feel like I am bored with beer, this may not be a good value. Anyway, that's all I've got. I will see you next time. See ya.